Hi there, buddy. If I can get this open before he gets over here, I might be able to use it to attack him. Yes, this seems quite lovely. But does he come over here is the real question. I think he does. I think we're okay here. And probably nothing in there. Just keep coming, little friend. Soon you'll meet a good friend of mine that I carry around all the time. He's somewhat small, but uh, he's quite friendly. A little bit touchy. go and investigate a little further down this hallway. Nothing there to speak of. Pretty sure this is just the bathroom and... Oh, you know what? That's not even locked, is it? That's why that wasn't working. Doesn't sound like anyone around here currently. This way. Or, you know, don't. That works for me, too. I think someone else is coming, though. Yes. I did not have enough time to do anything there. And there's a guard upstairs, too. Ooh, watch it. there are a number of uh, guards patrolling this area, so I must really take my time. Is someone there? No. You have a pounding headache for no reason. It's just how things work. There's someone walking over there. Hmm. Hello? That should be just above my head, so nothing to worry about. One issue is, I believe he walks around this uh, little catwalk area here, which can make him a bit of a danger while traveling around this room. Yeah. Hello? 
someone there. No. No one's here at all. Damn it. Of course you would be locked. Situate you out of the way. Floating in the air. Perfect spot for you. I'm sure everyone will admire your floating capabilities when they find you're in town. Okay. That is definitely still on, so we do not want to go down that way just now. off. Quite lovely indeed. Let's see what we have here. Foreman Hobart. Congratulations, Foreman. The grand opening of the exhibition is almost upon us. The preparations have gone extremely smoothly, and I must admit that I did not expect so thorough a job. Through the influence of you mechanists, this household has become both more efficient and more secure. I consider myself to be a practical man and a man of the world. I appreciate the transition this manor has undergone through its association with your master Karis. The devices he has sent are indeed wondrous. The Hammerites were always tramping about, moaning of doom and gloom. They kept our servants docile with their dogma, but did little else. Why, Father Norrell could be downright embarrassing when we had guests. However, your kind, with the first masked servants you've sent, has shown us how to make our servants obedient and the new priest is as civilized and reasonable as one could hope for. I hope we can continue this relationship, and I will help persuade Lord Gervasius to speak highly of your order when next they come before the Regent Council. Stuart Duma. Alright, Duma. I guess uh, Gervasius likes your your counsel and believes anything you say. That's fine. Let's just knock this Duma down and uh, everything will be fantastic. Sounds like we've got someone in the next room. And it is also locked. Um, let's see here. At least I thought I heard someone. I don't know. I don't think we're going to go out that way, though. I'd rather enter that room through a secret pathway, if at all possible. Just because I don't want to run headlong into someone without knowing who it is. Is this unlocked? Yes, it is. No one in here, so, uh... Just find a walk around. Let's see what we have to read today. Duma, we need a new gardener before I get back. The terrariums must be in tip-top shape. Karina loves plants, and I've been talking up the terrariums. If they don't look their best, I'm sunk with her. Duma, you must see this girl to believe her. Do your best. If Hobart isn't already overworked, get her to coordinate with the new gardener and get a crew planting trees outside. Draft servants or guards or whomever to do the work. 
and get to the trees from wherever you can on short notice. Hell, dig up, dig them up from Baffords if you need a source. Old Baffy will understand. He still owes me for the time he swindled me on that painting. You know, the one he swore was an original Durant. He knows I'm still annoyed about that, even if it was a prank. Bram G. P.S. Make sure to up the number of flower arrangements around the manor. It can be a drab place sometimes, and we should do anything we can to spruce it up for her first visit. Alright, let's see. Is there anything of any interest around here. It does look like they've definitely put in some new plants and pickaxes. Yes, um, whatever the hell that's about. And this is kind of open here, but I don't really see anything of interest. Is that? It looks like there's something on the carpet there. I don't know. No, I guess it's just, uh, just a little design. Uh oh. What do we have going on here? Someone with a nice little sword. decision, but I'm going to try it anyhow. No, no one's there at all. Turned out to be a fantastic decision. Nice little shovel there. That guy might be on his way over in this direction. Possibly through those doors. So I'll wait. Just a moment for him. And we have a nice little chest here. And it looks like we can get into that room from behind as well. Hello. As long as we take this as carefully as we did when we couldn't take anyone down, I think we should be, um, fairly okay. Hello there, mine. You are of no particular interest to me currently. So, whatever. This is just back to the room that we were at before. I thought I heard a little bit of humming coming from this room. These secrets can be quite effective at uh, keeping my presence unknown. All right. No clue where that guy went. He was here. But no longer. Hmm. I think he might be coming from that side. I'd quite like to know where he went. Well, that's open. Well, this is a nice spot to hide if I require it. What's that? Hello? Ah, child. Hmm? Didst not hear thee. Thou art so silent, I thought I was alone. Let me go. Let me go. Let me go. So, thou likest my new dwelling as well. Twas high time I replaced that old dotard, Norrell. 
There was not he could do for these people, save lead them into the muck that mires his own mind. That senile old fool doth not realize his time of faith is over. Help me. Please help me. Please help me. Following Lord Karras, twas so easy to lure Gervasius with choice baubles. Soon his exhibition will introduce more nobility to the wonders of our faith. They shalt wander through halls rendered safe by our craft, and be served by such docile helpers as thee. They shall gaze upon the wonders of fallen civilizations, and watch as we make it an attainable reality. How can they resist? So cold. So, cold. so very cold. So very cold. Meanwhile, I will attend to Norrell's former flock. Twas some effort, bending Gervasius to our will, but with Steward Duma's help and the right temptation, twas not that difficult. Someone wounds. Someone kill me. Someone kill me. Uh, good night, child. Leave me to my preparation. Return to thy duties. So cold. So very cold. So very cold. I don't know if that thing's gonna come out here. Doesn't seem like it. But, it doesn't sound like we want to go into that room. Otherwise we'll face uh, a servant and um, a guard in there. Be ever wary for the pernicious forces that array against us. For every flagstone there is a root which seeks to crack through it. For every wall there is a vine which seeks to tear it down. Know thou thy enemy, and be ever watchful. For only so may we prevail. Karis. Whatever you say, Karis. Sounds like they're just going to stay in there. So I might be okay to just uh, walk around without opening that door. Not much to, uh, to find in here so far. Pretty empty area. All right, well, we are, at the very least, on our way towards our goal. And that would be Garrus. He's a creepy looking guy. Quite dangerous. All right, uh, I don't see, uh-oh. -huh. I guess that's uh, probably from upstairs because we opened the door, but um, it sounded like he was in here. A nice little healing potion. Hopefully there will be no need for it. And here we just have an entryway if we wanted it, but we do not have any need for it right now.